All right, we're back. And yeah, we're done with the uh, main roster. Now let's move on to the other guys. I'm gonna try to pick Dan as quickly as possible. There we go. Wow, look at that. I got Dan. So we gotta do Dan, Akuma, and Bison. Now let's begin. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. That's that's Ryu's voice. So, man, what was Dan? Dan was like a really a nobody. He doesn't even speak. He grunts. That really sucks. I don't even know how to use the It's kind of hard. I had actually a figure of him, and it's kind of funny, right? I have a figure. I had a figure of him, of Dan. I think I spent like $40 on it. Opened it up, looked at it, sat on it for a couple of years, sold it for a couple of hundred dollars. But the deal almost didn't go through because of one little feature. The figure has a piece of Dan's hair that sticks off. I lost it. And I looked all over my house and I was like, please, I am so broke. I have zero money. I need to eat this week. You know, I'm tired of choosing between video games and food. Why can't I choose both video games and food for the week? So, <laughs> I found the piece of little, the strand of hair that goes to the figure. And it's kind of funny, right? Going downstairs, getting ready to ship it off to Malaysia or something like that, Indonesia. Where I think Dan is super big. Dude. And I dropped a piece of hair. The hair is brown. My steps are brown. There's a hole in my step where it could easily fall down. I freaked out. And I kept, gotta find the hair, gotta find the hair, gotta find the hair, gotta find the hair, gotta find it. And I kept doing that for like five minutes straight. And I eventually found the little that little strand of hair that you see there. Found that. I forgot how much I sold. I sold it for like maybe, I don't know, 100, 200? Almost close to $300 for an, a used figure. I was like, wow. You know. Wow, that was just... But anyway, long story short, I was able to eat and play video games that week. And I bought some new video games and food. Here I am. Yeah, I shouldn't have made that choice. The obvious choice was to choose the video games. <laughs> I mean, you know, the obvious choice was to choose the food, you know. But I got issues, you know. Piece of me wants the figures back. I had all of them. I had all of the Street Fighter 4 figures, Series 1 and 2. And uh, I had some soda. Soda toys. Soto. Soto or Soto? I shouldn't have used that. She got me this round. PC me wants to kind of see how far I can push this. Beautiful win. Yeah, but I had a couple of soda figures. 
Soto, Soto Street Fighter figures. I had all of the NECA Street Fighter series figures, Street Fighter 4 series. But the thing was, and I got them back in 2008, whenever Street Fighter 4 came out. Street Fighter 4 came out in 2008. Well, I got them and I opened them. I stood them like in my little room here and I sat on them for like years. You know, I just like left them somewhere. You know, and they were of no use to me, so I sold them. My goal was to actually do e-commerce with them, like start using them to, uh, you know, start an e-commerce business and start buying them from um, China and Japan. But video games and food was very important to me. So I, uh, I never got that e-commerce business going. Cut us up. My dad beat you and he's... Okay, I haven't been reading what he's been saying. I wonder if I start using strategy now. So far, I've been kind of cleaning house. I'm afraid to say that because as soon as you say it, that's when you start losing. Ah, oh, tech. He caught me in midair. I don't think I'm gonna win this. Yeah, I'm not winning this. Yeah, I wasn't winning this. Neither. I don't feel too confident. Or am I? Nah, I'm not confident. Man, guy! That's super annoying. You got me. That lady really needs to find another place to go because that whole, you know, like pointing and not picking up her groceries that are on the floor there and like, I guess, signaling for the police, that's annoying me. Come on. You should be calling the police on those young girls there watching. Well, I don't know why she, she That's really dumb. You're not doing anything to anybody. Alright. Why did that other shoot me? Man. I used to come out. 
Man, that would have been nice. Y'all yeah, lost. He could hit me from anywhere. Lock, but nothing I can do. I'll take the hit. Give him this piece of cheese. Come on! Come on! <laughs> He's like ridiculous. Now. Well, we were even. Now we're even. <clears throat> you win. That could have went either way. I was not expecting to win. But I'm very thankful that I did. Round one. Play. So they have no history, even though they have the same fighting style. But look, the male, where does the male or the deuce people go? It just disappears. See, it's the same voice, or it's Ken's voice, it's somebody's voice. I don't think it's Dan's own personal voice. It's like he's an afterthought. Like, oh, yeah, let's put this character in here. Probably could have won. Could have. Should have, but didn't. Oh, come on. Man. Ah, Sorely, sorely, I lost. Let's go again. <sighs> nice, keep it up. It's all okay. good. You win. Round two. Why? Adorkin. 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 Man. Okay. Adorkin. Let's just save the go ahead. Let's just take the loss. You do. Round three. Come on. Come on. Got him. KO. You win. That's kind of morbid. My dad could beat you and he's dead and he didn't love me. He cheated on my mom and he beat us. Like, man, dude, that's. Uh, just say, yeah. An old lady could beat you? And the old lady's dead. It's so black humorish. Okay. I like when he 
was too close. Oh, that was nice. Man. Man. Stay back. I don't know how to beat this dude. Because... Dan has to be, I, well, at least I feel like Dan needs to be kind of close to do his moves. He's like, I see it opening. I could just take the loss, or I could try to dwindle it, dwindle, dwindle, get him down to where I, could, I feel comfortable. Or, yes! That was pretty close. I was, I was just like, maybe I just allow myself to lose. All right, that you know, these two got history. Yeah, I don't know. You killed my father. Man, he had an issue with killing people's dads, man. Chill out. Stop killing fathers. You know, I mean, I mean, hey, I can't complain. He's in Thailand. <laughs> Just don't sink him on the black community. <laughs> Dark humor. Right, Dad? Our fathers didn't love us. he stays away from the black community he has an issue of killing fathers and lord knows we need our fathers ah nice all right all right that would have been nice if that oh i didn't hit me yeah i lost Let's just go out like, like a man. He lost his father. Who can beat everybody, but he's dead. Right, let's go. Dag, nabbit. Dropped the, the ball on this one. I really screwed the pooch. Yeah, let's just take the loss. Let's take the loss. I 
I'm really. Ah. So everything is worth. Wow, one. He got me in the corner. I gotta start fighting out of this corner. Dag nabbit. I never fully read the story. Let's read it this time. I was just laughing at the part where he killed his pops. That's who One, got the okay. Oh. It's all making sense. Okay. Oh. oh. Yeah, I'm done. Block anymore. Blocking takes health. Man. Man, let me win. I lost this take loss. You do. I don't know what to do. Let's look at the patterns. You know, I've been looking at the patterns. Been looking kind of one sided, you know? Look at a pattern here. I don't, know. I don't see too much of a pattern that I can exploit with my moveset. That would have been nice. Take a look. Take a look. Now he's charging, right? So he's not dropping back and doing the tiger shots. I'm trying to, it's like I'm looking, I'm looking. I just, I don't feel like thinking. But it's coming together. I think it is. Right now he's, he's getting really close. Man, that's pretty smart. Dang! <laughs> That's pretty smart of him. Let's do it again. Let's look at this. It's gotta be a pattern that I can explore. I knew not to jump in the air again. Hmm. 
I'm not seeing nothing I want. I want to explore. Not that I can, can't. Just it don't look too like. I don't see a winning formula. You do. Usually I see a formula by now. Like that's one that I could do. Like the moment he does it, I can. He has a like a split second where I can attack. So that's I can do that. But then you know when it comes to getting in close, what do I do? It's like I gotta kind of have to fall back and block. And hit him with a couple of grabs. So I guess that's the formula. <laughs> That's the formula. You know? Jump over the tiger shots. Hit him with combos and fireballs. When he gets super close, just throw. Let's see if I can put that into action. I, have, I need enough to, to hop over. See? Just... Gotta hop over them. And he's gonna switch up to close combat. Now he's switching to close combat. Oh. Mixing it up. You just hit him with a throw. Oh. That's the pattern I see. Is it the pattern I want to fight as? I don't really know if I like the pattern. Like, I want to play the game and not see the patterns. But I can't help it, you know? Now he's going to come in close, right? Too late though. I've already lost. Dang, caught me. You beat me. But that's the pattern. Let's exploit it. Make sure your block is always up when you're jumping over. So you can get a good hit. All right, Scott. Are you getting in close? Oh, I've got to watch that grab. Man, couldn't block all of that. So we got our exploit. Let's just put it into practice. Now he's doing the uh, post combat and just give him a good grab. What are you doing now, dude? Trying to back me up a little. See? You just got exploited. He's exploiting me now. All right, Scott. 
Nice, nice, nice. I'm really, really bad at like when they jump from one side to the other in close combat. That's how you exploit it. Exploit the game, get the fame. We're done. Not my best playthrough. Yeah, now he's all happy. They really threw this together in like five seconds. Yeah, but I'm done. Right? No hidden matches or fights. 